There's no doubt that conditions are inhumane. For two years, a local volunteer says he's been pushing for Manatee County leaders to make upgrades at their aging Palmetto-based animal shelter to help keep the animals cool. And as the hottest months of the year approach, he decided to take his concerns to social media, a move that ended up getting him terminated. Manatee County Animal Services is located off 25th Street West in Palmetto. Eight on your side's Allison Henning joins us there live tonight. Allison? Stacy Keith, David Daniels was a volunteer dog walker here for two years. He tells me he was trying to come up with some solutions to help keep the dogs in outdoor kennels cool in this sweltering summer heat. Cypress. Cypress has been by David Daniels' side since 2018. He's a rescue from the Manatee County Animal Shelter, a place Daniels walked dogs almost every day. Last week, he was shocked to receive this termination letter, a result of what's described as malicious statements posted on social media. Daniels says he turned to the public platform after sending more than 25 emails to county leaders over a two year span in a push for improvements to an outdoor kennel he feels is inhumane during Florida's hot summers. They get walked outside to go to the bathroom or whatever, and where they get hot, obviously, and then we have to put them back in these hot kennels, and it was just heartbreaking to do that day after day for month after month. Commissioner Carol Whitmore tells Eight on Your Side up to $400,000 was set aside and approved last fall for repairs at the aging facility, starting with upgrading the electrical system. Now that's past us, and we are moving forward. We have generators ordered. I'm sure you've probably seen that. Uh, we're going to have in, uh, air conditioning on the outside when it gets hot. Manatee County Animal Services says overhead exhaust fans are expected to arrive next week. Sunshades are being installed along the volunteer walkway as well as cooling paint to help with hot pavement. The shelter is also providing dogs with frozen treats daily to help keep them cool. Make it happen. Please, for the dogs, make it happen. Make this the, prior, the priority that it should have been two years ago. And county leaders I spoke with today tell me a new animal shelter is on the horizon to replace this one. Eight million dollars has already been set aside for the new facility, but in the meantime, the county says it is doing what it can to keep the conditions here safe for staff, volunteers, as well as the animals. Reporting live in Palmetto, Allison Henning, 8 on your side.